Hello everyone, welcome to another one of my episodes. I know I haven't started from the station for a while, right? So we're just starting right now. We're just going to do a regular episode. Um, You know what, should I use... Yeah, you know what, we're going to be in Bohan, so we're just going to be using the Wasteland mod and probably VP call out. So let me just get a partner. At least we could just, um, I guess, do just a regular episode. I don't know. We'll see how it's going to turn out because the game is unpredictable. You really don't know how long it's going to last, so let's just go with the floor right now. And All right, let's go. I don't know what car am I going to pick. All right, no, not this. Not that. Not that. No. This always looks decent to me. Yeah, you know what? Let's pick this. Let's pick this fusion for now. Um, Probably just got to clean it up. Look mad dirty. All right, so we're just gonna get started with this episode, man. How many of you guys watched the dunk contest last night? Cause it was surprising. Cause I'm always like, every year is like, oh, okay, same bullshit. But this year, for some reason, um, Lafine actually killed it. It made some really good changes. <laughs> Only 19 years old from UCLA, definitely. He's, I, I guess, he's gonna make a difference, man. So. I mean, he definitely made the game, not the game, but, you know, dunk contest fun to watch last night because he came out with some crazy ass dunk. I don't know how this guy get up in the air and make changes like that, but it was definitely worth it, man. But you can find, probably Gio would talk more about this because he's more of the, <laughs> the person that watched, I mean, this guy watched almost every game, so that's all Gio. But he actually had me watching it last night, so... Yeah, so let's get back to LCPDFR. What the hell is this guy doing? Yeah, so um, between me and Gio, I'm a football guy. Gio is a basketball guy, so it's like we always had our differences or whatever. I'm just showing myself available. All right, I thought, oh, I thought he usually sent a call like right away. And for most of you guys that have been, that's been asked, okay, respond to a, right, I just respond to it, but the sun was so bright, I didn't even see, anyway, let's just try to get to the location right now. Oh, a shot fire, alright, let's go, let's go. Yeah, for most of you guys that have been asking me how to install the EMB, I, for some reason, I think it's because of the video card, that's why the EMB looks so much different than you guys, I don't know. Because I've seen as soon as DCP installed his, and his game looked exactly like mine now, so I don't know. I would say the video card kind of make um, Crying NB version 3 look different a little bit. I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. This person is using an AK. Oh, shooting at my car, too. All right. You're done. You're done. You're done. Stay down. Stay down. All right, I got him. Oh, this car probably ran over him. I don't. All right, so let's, um, whoa, whoa, dude, come on. Really? But y'all didn't see that. Can I help you? <laughs> All right, so we're going to have to block off the road so we could take care of this. Yo, you, you really going to play it off like that? Look, you about to get hit again. All right, so I'm just going to block off the road after this guy. All right, and this car already ran over. Oh, lady, like really? Anyway, we picked up the AK. Um, you're not gonna see this. Um, you know what? Let me try to see if I could clear the area. Maybe all the cars come over from here. Okay, there you go. All right, so I'm gonna block off the road. This is my way of doing it. I guess the GTA way. As realistic as we could try to be, but at the end of the day, this is still a game. So we try our best to match it up to reality, but it is what it is. So right now, I'm calling the corner. They should be here any second from now to take care of the body. I picked up the weapon, which was the AK, of course, and I guess that's about it. We just gotta make sure we take care of this crime scene and leave the area. All right, you see this guy was trying to come around. <laughs> yeah, for, I guess, EMB version, um, Cry EMB version three. That's, I guess, since I, since I got it, I just haven't changed to no other ENB like that. I was gonna do Ice Enhancer, 
but the only thing I don't like about it is the light is not as bright as this or as realistic as this. So that's why I just didn't use it like that. But the the environment, the cars, you know, everything just look amazing with Ice Answer. But if you're doing LCPDFR, I don't know. I, I don't think it's the best for LCPDFR. That's why I use Cry EMB version 3 or Eye Candy version 5 or 6. But this this look freaking amazing. So see how you can see over there. It's one thing that's bad about it. You see the trees. I don't know for some reason they okay. The trees in front of me look nice, but the trees like a little bit further down. Just showing um, our last incident code for suspicious person. All right, show me responding. I don't know for some reason VP call out override over um. Plugins, like all the plugins call outs. I don't know. If I pick, like, if I have two call, oh, damn, it crashed. So, all right, I was just talking to my VP call out, but it crashed. It crashed from time to time, like that. So, <clears throat> most likely, I am going to have to reload the game, but let's do a couple more. Probably traffic stop calls, or if we get any calls from the plugins, and we'll see. But, what the hell is this lady doing? I can't believe they're selling those now. Was it gonna be the suspect? I don't know. Let me just check her. But it feel like she was going to be the suspect because she's the only one around here right now. All right, Miss. Do you have any idea on you? I'm just gonna make sure she doesn't have any weapons or anything like that. We really didn't get no description of the suspect, so. I don't know, it could be anybody right now. But anyway, VP call out did crash, so I'm probably just gonna ask her a question, whatever, question her or whatever, and keep going with our day, man. And of course the fusion looked decent, man. The only thing I didn't like about that fusion is that the interior is not well detailed. There's nothing like Sometime I I wanted to show you guys the interior view. She has been stopped. Oh, no active warrant. Yeah, I wanted to show you guys the interior view, but it looked it looked crappy. All right, so let's get out of here, partner. So most likely we're just gonna do regular traffic stop, and if we get any calls from um the plugins, because VP call out just crashed. So the only way for me to get it back so to actually reload. But anyway, we're just gonna end this episode soon anyway. This was gonna be a short one. <laughs> but I got a lot of episodes coming for y'all anyway, so I'm trying out a lot of stuff. What the hell this guy oh because I'm using this. Alright, I'm just fixing my car. But there's a lot of you guys that's been asking me if oh to what um computer is decent for GTA 4, this and that. Um, I would suggest you guys to start getting ready for GTA 5, like trying to get a computer that's stable enough for GTA 5, because even the website are updating, like they putting GTA 5 mods of, will be available soon. So imagine, um, because that was the same way it was for San Andreas for me too, because I remember I used to mod San Andreas like crazy, I'm talking about change all the players, like change everything. Just a regular traffic stop. I was just checking to see if it's still working. Yeah, it is still working. All right. In no case, okay. let's get out of here, sir. I was just checking to see if um the scripts are still working, if um LCPDF are still working. But anyway, yeah. So I think you guys should be getting ready to, I guess, mod. Uh, um, I mean, my GTA Five. Because um, if you get a computer just enough for GTA 4, you're gonna be mad when you see us modding. Like, let's say if you start seeing videos from me with GTA 5 mods or GTA 5, um, or I'm, I'm not sure if L LSPDFR is gonna be that fast or because it, it takes a lot of work to get LCPDFR like, to work and stuff like that. But I don't know. But, you know, as soon as they get their hands on these files, you know. Everybody's gonna get to work. So this is how us, the modder, or like the modding community, does it. So I remember, cause I remember San Andreas. San Andreas was good. 
Yeah, but by the time you saw the GTA 4 graphic and how you could improve it, everybody left San Andreas. I mean, not, you know, some people are still sticking to San Andreas and stuff like that. But as for me, I would never go back. I mean, I probably would play San Andreas, but I think GTA 4 is way better than San Andreas when it comes to modding and stuff like that. There's particular mods that's only available to San Andreas that I wish that was available for GTA 4. But I guess it's gonna be the same thing. So the GTA, as soon as GTA 5 come out um, for PC, you know we're gonna get to play this and that. A couple months later, it's gonna be like a player, um, a player change from changing the cars, from changing texture, from changing skins, and you know have control over scripts, have control over what um, people's. You know, it's it's you never know how it's gonna turn out. So. I'm just waiting for the surprise. That's why I haven't been playing on pay citation. All right, so you can't pull over, buddy. Anyway, um, I do have to reload scripts because it felt like you see I haven't gotten no calls like that. So expire registration. Side of the road, stupid. All right, I guess we're just gonna pull the second guy over. Yeah. So I mean, my suggestion to you guys is if you get in a PC for just GTA 4 and you you think you might not like GTA 5. I mean, it's rare <laughs> because by the time you start seeing like real mods, like let's say these mods for GTA 5 with the graphic of GTA 5, and you're gonna, I don't know, you're gonna want it. And imagine if you spend a lot of money on that PC. So I would suggest you to get a PC powerful enough, not just for GTA 4, but for GTA 5. If you're on a budget, just get something that, I don't know. In between but that's just enough to play GTA 5 so I mean just just I mean check the requirement for GTA 5 and I don't know it should be able to handle it and uh, hopefully GTA 5 will be um, a little bit more optimized for I guess modding and stuff like that hopefully they're not just gonna take the stuff from the 360 version or the PS3 version and then just drop it and make a PC version. Because I feel like that's what they did with um, the PC version of GTA 4. So hopefully it will be more improved. Um, <laughs> most guys was worrying about um, two citation. If it's not going to be moddable. It, of course it will. It's I mean, it's PC gaming. We always do that anyway. So, I mean, ever since I got introduced to that, I've been loving it so far. But, guys, I'm just giving this guy a ticket. I have to get out of here, too. Hopefully, you guys are going to enjoy this episode, man. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Until next time.